Oh, that's Vaseline, y'all. So, hi, y'all. How are y'all? I'm currently babysitting China, and I'm about to get on my meeting. And I got my um batch day for my new job. It's hot right now. Okay, so, like, my last video, I tried to record me and my boyfriend eating Chick-fil-A, but, like, I smack when I eat. So, that did not work out. But I'm just getting on my, my Zoom. And then after, I'm going to wash my car and go pick up my little sister. And I'm washing face shirts while I wait on the meeting. But, um, that's Shauna. That was a short meeting because last meeting we talked about my grades and stuff. But, um, I'm just about to show y'all me vacuuming my car and then, like, getting my life together. So I'm taking, I mean, I guess this is pretty normal, but eh, I just don't like all the crumbs and dirt. So I'm taking the floor mat off the dog. And then my mount too. Great. It's definitely dirty right here. Yay, we love that. Since I didn't go to the gym, this is gonna be my sweat workout for the gym. I am already sweating, y'all. It's hot. Let me get the vacuum. Ooh, I don't know what that was. That was cringy, oh my God. My dad's a detail, y'all. And like, he rearranged everything since I last worked with him. So me finding the extension cords, the, the damn vacuum was hard enough. Let's get this party started. I'm gonna keep my phone in the shade because it is really hot outside. So I can't really get any good angles, but you're just gonna see me bobbing and weaving between these doors. I left the tripod outside, but my clothes are done washing, so I'm gonna put it in the dryer. Oh, everything's falling. Okay. I was about to stop filming this video because of something that happened, but you know, I'm gonna just push through and give y'all content. Today's the day of my life, so we're about to vlog. Also, didn't tell y'all what I was wearing. Oops. I found five dollars in my pants for my tips, so we're getting Starbucks. Caramel, I'm sorry, can I get a venti caramel ribbon crunch with almond milk, uh, caramel lineup, and light whip? Anything else? No, thank you. I'm sorry, did you get the caramel lineup? The caramel lineup? Yes, please. Thank you. I have to ask for caramel lineup because I realized when I would get the caramel ribbon crunch at some spots, they do the caramel without you asking for the caramel lineup. But like this spot in particular forgets to do the caramel lineup. And when you ask, look at all that caramel, like, yes. Okay, so with Taylor School, like the first week they gave us this car tag that had like a number and they, um, they came to your car, like they made traffic real bad. They came to your car, asked you, what your child name was and i'm like what's the point of even giving us the car tag with the number if you're gonna ask our child's name they're like they're waiting for the children to remember the car tag girl if my baby see my car know who that person is that's supposed to pick them up and get in the car willingly i know some dumb kids out there but i don't know who got kidnapped last year but we don't need to go through all of that I'm, well i don't care I'm, I don't know. I, I know it's a safety issue but like they're not even doing it anymore it's like the third week of school so and Taylor's over here talking to somebody. Oh, what's going on? Hey, Chunka Monker. One of my associates was yelling at this boy, talking about if he hit her brother, she was gonna swing on him. I and saw her get in the kick top. <laughs> and she was also like, she was yelling at her brother, being a mother. She was like, stop, talk, stop, t t uh, stop saying come in the bathroom and all that stuff. And then her brother was like, he be calling me a bitch every day. Ooh. She was covering hands. Stop calling my brother a bitch. And da da da. I saw her. I saw her. I was like, oh, what's happening? What's and happening? Then the, the lady police officer 
was like, do y'all need to mediate this and stuff? And <laughs> she was like, she dropped her phone and she placed it in her bag. And she was like, if you swing on my brother, I'm going to swing on you. And then da 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 Ooh. Hello. Here we are once again. I had a video planned, but like, it didn't go as planned because I'm sad. And it's currently 12 a.m. Wait. Yes. 12 a.m. And I just dropped my boyfriend off at home. And he's asleep already because he has work. I have work too. But I'm sad and contemplate life once again. So, y'all about to wind down with me and be sad with me because I've got nobody to talk to. And I need content. <laughs> I just wanted to see if I did the transitions right. Anyways, my beats are dying. So, oh, I need to make this talk. They just died. Great. So, um, I'm gonna make this talking part kind of quick, I guess. Don't mind my bed. I need to do a whole night reset in this 12.05. And like, I'm really, I wouldn't say I'm sad, but I, I don't know how I feel like. I feel like I'm behind, but I'm literally not behind. Like, I just graduated. I'm in college. But, I don't know. I feel like I put all my eggs in one basket. And I don't like how I'm feeling about it. Because, you know how I told you on the last video? How I have the scholarship. I was going to pay for my associate's degree. And I have to work with them, uh, the hospital, in order to get, like, the full. Would it be considered a full ride for two years? I don't know. Basically, my school paid for it. But, like I said, I wanted, I, I don't know, like, I feel like I should have just went to a four-year and just did all of that. Because I feel like I'm missing out on stuff. Like, I don't know, like, I don't know what I'm missing out on. Like, the only friend I have in Charlotte is my boyfriend. And we're in the same program. And I just feel like I'm behind on things. Like, I wish I could have did early college classes. Like, I tried to do it over do it over COVID, but my <laughs> the school got hacked, and so my information wasn't there anymore. So that ruined that opportunity. And like I'm just conflicted because I'm not sure if this is really the path I want to go go ooh, go with. I mean, oh hi, hey, charges. I mean, I know it is because I like to help people and. I like to help people and it's a, what's it called? It's a sustainable, the word I'm looking for. It's a sustainable career where like, it's reliable. I'll always have a job and I'll always be educated. But it's just like, I don't know, I think I'm lazy. And I just feel like, I know time flies, like life flies by so fast and time flies by so fast. Like I could have sworn it was my first day in ninth grade yesterday. And it just, I just feel, I don't know, I just feel behind. I don't know behind in what, because I'm not competing with anybody but myself. But I just feel like I just need a break from school. But I don't know if I take a break, I won't be going back. And, like, there's careers you can have without having a degree. But, like, let's be for real. I don't know how to do anything with my hands, and I'm not that smart. So, I don't know what I'm doing to myself. But hopefully, y'all, I get through this year. This year is just two semesters. And then after this year, I can over, no. Uh, next summer, I'm taking my T's test and nurse's aid, and then I'll be getting into the program. And I'll be taking those major courses. So hopefully I push through. I really do wanna push through and not give up because I'm literally not doing anything. I just, I'm overwhelming myself. Excuse me, we're trying to make it seem like I'm supposed to be here when it's just getting started. But anyways, I feel like me giving myself a reset will make me feel better. So now that I got the whole rundown and the spiel, I think I'm going to do another time lapse again of me like, or I'll just come back to y'all when my room is clean. Like, I have to fold laundry. Let me show y'all. Oh, let me clean this. Okay, so 
Oh, my desk area is pretty clean. Like, over here is usually pretty clean. That's where China was laying. But I need to clean up my bed. Um, Put this tote back up there and put the art supplies back in the art tote. And I don't know why I've been procrastinating. Pick that up. Fold all of that laundry. And, like, after I get my area to look the way I want it to, I was going to, um, I was about to say do an everything shower, but I don't even shave anymore. I get waxed. So, everything shower, like, washing my hair and washing my ass. That's it. And, like, the locking process of my hair is going, it's going well. I just don't like the outgrown look. It looks so, ugh. But, y'all, you know, hopefully I push through. Because there's really nothing for me to be overwhelmed about. I'm doing it to myself. So, wind down with me. <laughs>